sponsored by Strategic Wealth Designers. The uncertainty of the pandemic and upcoming election may have a lot of folks concerned for their retirement plans. CBS 4's Nick McGill sat down with Mike Reeves from Strategic Wealth Designers to discuss retirement mistakes to avoid right now. All right, I'm joined by Mike Reeves with Strategic Wealth Designers. And Mike, we're talking retirement. What are the biggest mistakes that those that are close to retirement should be avoiding right now? You do not want to lose a lot of money in a short period of time. I know that sounds simple, but go back to this last crash. You had people that were invested, over-invested in the stock market. In the beginning of February, maybe they had a million dollars. By the end of March, they only had $700,000. So what you want to do now is make some changes. You got kind of that get out of jail free card and opportunity to fix things. You want to go through that portfolio, make some changes, be prepared for a really difficult time. Um, you don't want to have to go back to work in retirement. You want to enjoy yourself. That's right. All right. Now, your team has a term called election paralysis. Do us a favor. Tell us what that is and how does that impact investors right now? What you see a lot of times during an election, before or even uh, after, people want to see the results. They want to understand the impact of the election before they change anything. The problem with that is if I've got a hole in my financial plan or in my investment strategy now, I'm certainly going to still have that hole after. You want to deal with things now. You want to fix things at this point. Go and get a second opinion from a financial advisor or fiduciary that's going to act in your best interest. I would encourage you to stay away from folks that only sell one product. They tell you this one product will fix everything. You don't want to do that. You want to have a very blended strategy that will protect you in very difficult investing times. Yeah, not putting all your eggs in, in one basket. Mike, with everything that has happened, people who are retired or close to retirement don't really have a lot of time to correct their portfolio here. What is the most important step they can take then in financial planning to insulate themselves from a major market crash? You want to invest differently today as a baby boomer than you did 40 years ago. So 40 years ago or 20 or 30, you might be really aggressive buying that hot stock. You don't want to do that now. You want to get a stress test to understand how much risk is in your portfolio. And during a really difficult time, not the one we had just a few months ago, but I'm talking at 2008 to 2009, where some people were down 50%. You want to design a portfolio that would stand up during that time. Maybe you're only down 5 to 15% because you had no new money coming into that portfolio. Before, you had new investments uh, that you could purchase at lower prices. That's off the table. Create some peace of mind. Do the stress test now. Be prepared for the rough times. All right. You can uh, read more financial advice from Strategic Wealth Designers on CBS4Indy.com. Mike, thanks for joining us. Thank you.